One of the world's most influential businessmen is taking on the government over its coronavirus lockdown. Elon Musk says on Twitter he has reopened his factory in California in violation of local government orders. Chief Correspondent Jonathan Hunt has the latest. After railing for weeks against California's restrictions on manufacturing, Elon Musk restarted production at his California plant on Monday, tweeting, quote, I will be on the line with everyone else. If anyone is arrested, I ask that it only be me. With the Tesla factory shut down, revenue obviously is falling fast, while other auto companies are reopening production lines, among them Toyota in Indiana today, General Motors, Ford and Fiat Chrysler in Michigan, either late this week or early next. But officials in Alameda County, California, like many in the Bay Area, are moving slowly, arguing Tesla first needs to show it can operate safely. California Governor Gavin Newsom backed those county health officials today, but said he believed progress is being made. My belief and hope and expectation is as early as next week uh, they will be able to resume. But Tesla has filed a lawsuit in federal court accusing the Alameda County Health Department of overstepping federal and state restrictions, while Elon Musk once again took to Twitter Saturday, writing, quote, frankly, this is the final story. Straw. Tesla will now move its HQ and future programs to Texas slash Nevada immediately. California Assemblywoman and former Labor leader Lorena Gonzalez fired back with this succinct tweet. Musk replied, message received. Experts say that while Musk may want to move production out of California, it would cost a fortune and take anywhere from 12 to 18 months. Musk certainly has the money, those same experts argue, but does he have the time? Brett? Jonathan, thank you.